Hello and welcome back to God of War. When we left off, we finished the quest for Brock and he gave us another one. And that's what we're going to do. Uh, maybe? Oh. Zara, hey, do you have a gate I can use by chance? No? Okay. I think this is the right way. <clears throat> Excuse me. Kind of scared me. Okay. So we want to go. I can't. Oh, here we go. Okay. Uh, so now we want to go down the hall. So. I guess right here? Maybe? Amir, what else did the serpent tell you when you spoke? Kinda sounded important. I'm sure it's nothing. He just said the boy seemed familiar to him. Me? That's impossible. Don't I quite agree. Unless, perhaps, he refers to something yet to be. It is said that when Jormungandr and Thor battle at Ragnarok, their clash so violently shakes the Tree of Life that it splinters, casting the serpent backward through time, even before his own birth. What? That is madness. Well, I did say not to concern yourself. What? Makes no sense. All this time travel shenanigans. Alright, so we like we go this way. What? Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 merrily. Life is but a dream. When you Mimir, build the poop. Why did you say Tyr felt responsible for what Odin did to the Giants? There was an incident shortly after the forging of Mjolnir, when Tyr arranged a diplomatic meeting between Odin and the Giant Kings. Well, this was when the Long War was young, when victory was still a thing dreamed of, and the Jotnar might have tipped the balance between Aesir and Vanir. Odin had persuaded Tyr that the hammer was merely a deterrent, a means to broker peace from a position of strength. Tyr was hopeful to convince all parties they would prosper best through peace. He knew the giants were deeply concerned about the hammer, a super weapon in hands they did not trust. But they trusted Tyr. Tyr always believed the best in people, and taking Odin at his word in his desire for peace, he brought the Raven King to Jotunheim. Uh, from there, things unraveled quickly. The giants anticipated Odin's trickery and exposed his true agenda to spy and steal their secret wisdom. With magics, they expelled Odin from their realm and cursed him never to return. Frustrated, Odin visited his fury upon the giants of Midgard. Thor unleashed Mjolnir's might upon any giant he could find. None could stand against the tide of slaughter that followed. And at last, it seems, with Tyr's aid, they retreated. The tower disappeared, no giants could be found in Midgard, and no man nor god has set foot in Jotunheim since. Land Suther Canyon. That's a boat. Also a boat. Come on. <sighs> Just 
a peaceful little boat ride. Ooh. And we're here. You see any green ravens? Huh? Hidden area discovered. Pardon me. See a shiny. So and jump. And we Brock, are you even here, my dude? What is that? Oh. And yes, I did hear yawn. We're like almost there. Hey, bro. Well, look at who decided to show. What up? Talk to this here, Reen. Uh, what? I can't hear thoughts from Reen's, bro. It's talking to me. It's in Bari. Ha! Knew it. He says he went to the Vellander mines to observe his mistake. But then the Soul Eater attacked, so as he was being ripped apart, he cast a spell that removed his soul and put in this ring. And then he... What about all his stuff? Uh, huh? Anvari had a workshop here with all sorts of posh doodads and ornatory tools. And one beaut of a hammer. You make mention of it still in there? Uh, you're upsetting him. Your point? You fellas take on Vari with you and go have a look-see. If you find his hammer, I'll whip up something real nice for you. Real nice for you. Hey now, don't go forgetting your entry stone. Thanks, dude. Vari isn't happy about us taking his stuff. I do not care. I'm not gonna tell him that. <coughs> Pardon on me. Full health, good. Oh. News to me that I have to press both buttons at the same time. Yes, I, I do. I uh, did. And Vari says this dwarf was part of his crew. That he died because of his mistakes. He sounds sad. The ring's grief is of little importance, boy. Oh. 
Is there somewhere that I can like get some stuff to throw at that? Oh, right there. Okay. Please. It's not doing nothing. Okay. Would like to get in there. All right, let's climb. First off, pick this up. Ooh, there was something right here as well. Thank you. Alright, boy. We're gonna shoot this thing and then I'm assuming we're gonna go flying upwards, right? Oh, he did not like that. Warning us not to go down there. Stop listening to the ring, boy. You cannot be trusted. You're dead. Not like silence that ring boy. I don't know how. Okay. Take that, nerd. Please be something good and not hex over. Okay, I'll take it. Oh, yeah. Over. All right, a levator. <laughs> oh, so that's how you get in here. Here, boy. Yes, sir. It's another one of those maps. Oh, it is a treasure map, eh? Kneel before four. All right, so what did I miss here? Must have been something down this way. Um, I can climb up here? Yeah.
Hello. Oh. Alright. Now, gotta line this up just right. And then hit it with a whale! Traveler, guard up. And a traveler all at the same time. Where do you see either one of them? Oh, there's the traveler. Okay, y'all. Oh, that's the soul eater right there. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no. Dead soul eater. What's a soul eater even doing here? What do you mean it's your fault? Boy, ignore him. It's sort of tough for me to ignore. Yeah, no kidding. It's re really freaking <laughs> shrieking. Oops. Okay. Go up here. Very good, very good. Over here. Hex over, thank you. Drop. Okay, that's where I'm supposed to go, but I don't want to yet. I'll come over here. I want to come over here. And then I want to come over here. Thank you. He says this chest will trigger a bunch of traps. Good. I see no traps. Sounded so sure about it. Oh, I'm sure we're not done yet. Alright, then we climb up here. That was lucky. Did I accidentally knock him off? the side, even though he can fly. That's pretty cool. Totally by accident, too. Not on purpose. Alright. I mean, totally on purpose, not by accident. Yep, that's what I meant. Okay, so we like climb up here. Can I not? 
out the balloon? No. Okay. Jump. Jump. Please be good. Axe over. Okay. We. What's that noise? What's the crackling noise? Is it that? It's really not a good sound, if I do say so. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, there's a wheel thing. We can slide down there. Yeah, okay. Turn the wheel. He says his workshop is up there. But I know, I know. Don't trust the talking ring. And we jump. This looks like a one. Hello. Where'd you go? Hey. Anybody else? It is over. What is this? So, well, that's greatest attacks for being able to introduce spawn. Great, it restores a small amount of health as well. Oh, I like that. Boy, father, please just listen. Invari's crew did something bad here. He's glad you destroyed his life, and he's sorry you kept trying to trick us. His hammer is just through this gate. Do you believe the talking ring, boy? I do not know. Open. Yes, thank you. Good boy. Boy. Sir. Going in the journal. What does it say? Removing an ancient soul and domesticating it as a beast of burden was surprisingly easy. They followed my every command and appeared to possess no free will, sense of self-preservation, or even hunger. Well, not until it turned poor Lit into ashes, not even his soul remained. A lack of their own must be what drives them to immolate the souls of others. My soul eaters are ab an abomination. Several were sent to Muspelheim at the request of Surtur, but... He will use them for I shudder to consider. Another to Matsugnir at Kanansgard. 
That fool can burn for all I care. My immediate concern is the dwarves of the Volander mines. I pray I'm not too late to undo my mistake. <laughs> well, I'm afraid you might be. <laughs> hmm. This is a fine hammer. Invari says thank you. Alright, so... Watch this. Can we keep him? We will talk to the blue one. Oh, hey. There any more of you? Oh, here we are. Okay. Alright, easy peasy. And we just want to get out of here. Well, this wasn't as bad as I thought it might have been. I didn't have to kill a soul eater. Hey, dude. You two find that hammer? Or you too busy looting every keyhole and cranny? Here, the alchemist hammer. His spirit is a nuisance. Yeah, Anvari always was an asshole. Hell of an alchemist, though. Hand him over here and I'll melt him down. What? You're going to melt down your friend? A trapped soul's what I need to give your reward some extra oomph. You don't want it? Father, we can't do that. Here, you hold on to him. He's really useful, I promise. <sighs> Fine. So long as he proves his worth. Kid's a bit of a softy, huh? Well, he'll grow out of it. He's done it? Let's do it. Alright, so... I need a pure essence of realms, however I get one of those. What the fuck ever? Um, alright. Well, whatever you say, mine dudin. So we got a new bestiary thing. It should be under Fryings and Vari. Vari wasn't very helpful at first, but something about seeing that dead soul eater in the land suit their minds made him realize he was being kind of a jerk. I think he feels guilty because he and some other dwarves were experimenting with ancients he there and accidentally created soul eaters. Glad we didn't have to fight anymore. Anyway, his soul is still trapped in a ring. Brock wanted to melt him down. He can be so mean sometimes. But I convinced Father to keep him, and now he's part of our group. Father even uses Anvari's soul as an enchantment sometimes. Must be hard being trapped in a piece of jewelry, but Anvari doesn't complain too much. I've gotten plenty good at ignoring him. Alright, so we got some you. Hey. I do like this. But this is helpful, like, now, so... Uh... Tality, luck, cooldown, defense, cooldown. Runic, vitality, cool. Okay, so do we have a runic? We have a vitality. We could use this. Do we have a runic anywhere? Whoa. Yaws. All right, so we'll replace this with this. Very good. All right, so here's here's the thing. We started out friends, and it was cool, but it was all pretend. We want to do this, so I am going to travel to the lake and then we will go from there summit hidden chamber wildwood's edge please you know what we'll just go here and maybe there's a boat here where's my drink 
Why is Odin so desperate to find a way into Jotunheim anyway? He's convinced the giants hold the key to changing his fate when Ragnarok comes. They are the Aesir's oldest enemies, after all. And it's their army that's supposed to do him in in the end. But more than that, he covets their gifts of prophecy. He wants to know what they know and see what they see. So much suffering could have been avoided if his insatiable curiosity was not so much stronger than his wisdom. What do you mean? Ah. Remind me to tell you why they call him the Lord of the Hanged. Please? Load. And go. And go. <laughs> All right, please be a boat. Thank you very much. And we will follow the blue. Is he asleep? Looks like he There's might be asleep. Whoa. Oh, good eye, good eye. I was looking at the world serpent. if he's so horrible. It's my career! And if you mean to make your career as a counselor to kings, you can't very well rule out petty maniacs. Available positions are scarce enough. My first master was a cruel piece of work as well, but I learned through him the enduring power of wit, which served me well with kings and gods alike. I couldn't have been much older than you when I started. A fairy king's errand boy, an unofficial jester. By night, my mates and I had the run of the forest. Good fellows, they called us. Never spikes to the last. They'd get up to all manner of mischief, making fools of the local mortals. But as long as our lord was kept amused, we were spared the consequences. Oh. Then one day he was not amused, and I saw fit to move on. Thankfully, the ages and roads travelled since then have turned me from that merry wanderer into the paragon of virtue you see before you today. All right. This. Oh, I heard it. Did you hear it? Hey. I heard it. Is it like right above Are we me? Lost? Nah. New version of Sea Cleaner is available. Dude, there it is. I knew I heard it. Get out of here. Okay. So, I'm not a fan of the way this looks. I think it's just because I can hear the world serpent breathing and it's freaking me out a little bit. Treasures from all different realms. You think that Fafnir went to Alfheim too? I do not know. Aren't you curious? He sounds interesting. We go to the storeroom to collect anything useful for our journey. Not to learn more about the dwarf. Fafnir was a rather interesting fellow, little brother. <laughs> Perhaps I'll tell you a story one day. Little brother. Just make sure you watch each other's backs in the storeroom. Wouldn't want to lose my loyal customers. Is there another? Aha. Oh, whatever. I nailed it. Alright, come on.
Okay. Now. This doesn't look too creepy anymore. There's something up there. Hmm. Something up where, boy? Reverse. Uh oh. It must have gotten here first. There's a lot of bad stuff over here, huh? Let's do this. We want to get rid of these guys first, right? Let's go. Freak in. Ah! Get out of here. In the face. Uh -oh. This one, father. Good job, boy. They were harder than I thought. Nah. All right, let's hope that it's not freaking bells that I... Oh, no, it is. Alright, there's two of them. Third one can't be too far. What's that? Well, boy. Uh, we've seen these before. It's a runic chest. We have to hit these bells in quick succession, and it'll open. However... Oh, hello. Nailed it. I do not know where the th there it is. Okay, so the eye right here. Father, look up there. Yeah, good eye. A little low. Still a little low. A little high, a little high. Oh, oh. There you go. He's done it. Um, excuse me? Now where do we go from here? We didn't do it in time, boy. We didn't do it in time. Okay. What's that? Oh, man, excuse me, that was dead on. Alright, I think we got eight of both the apples and the rage or whatever it's called. Let's come in here. This looks like a good way to go, right?
What is going on in here? I hear another crow. Right. Alright, so clearly this is the way we're supposed to go, so I want to go back now. Hey. Please die. Oh, you're lucky. You're lucky. Please die. I refute that that missed you. Alright, just be patient. Just be patient. We got this. We can do it. Excuse me. Yeah, I'm not going to do that yet. Because we got to kill this raven. And then I want to go back and explore. So, just hold your horses. Yeah, no. I'm not going to look at... Oh, he's done it. Okay, yeah. This is, if you want to be, like, if you want to go the quick way, I guess, that's the way you would go. Aha! See, I knew it was good to come back. There's a chest in the chest. What do we get? Soft steel? Bro. And worlds? Seven whole world serpent scales. Are you kidding me? Here. Boy. Yes, sir. Boy. Treasure map. All right. Yeah. Getting all the treasure maps, please. Thank you. So is this is going to turn the bridge. Looks like the reavers made it inside. I hope they didn't take all the treasure. We'll phone go that way. Oh, I guess this is room numero boom. Greetings. Ow. You know what? I don't want to mess with you guys. Treasure and know what's done. Another Keep your expectations stone. low, boy, and you will never be disappointed. Words to live by, Kratos. Words to live by. Okay, let's get the poop out of here. All right, now this should open up door number. Um, excuse me. Please get out of here. Bye. They caught you off guard. I wasn't expecting them. Exactly. <gasps> Aha. See? Number two. Oh, poison. What's right by um, excuse me, he's a level 7? I didn't sign up for this. What up? Ow. Holy moly! I win. You lose. 
There's nothing but poison in this one. And the stupid bird statue. And useful resources. A Viking. We should kill these guys. The main reason we are here, boy. However, many of these chests have been empty. Squeeze. Probably by the reavers. I hope they didn't take Sindri's whetstone. That's another stone. Okay. Can we, like, get some HP from any of these? That'd be great. Although, I guess we take what we need anymore. Let's go. Let's get the balls out of here, boy. Right, and this should open up the way forward. <laughs> Nothing? Alright. Remember what I told you about expectations, boy. Keep them okay. low. I remember. Still, Were we not good feeling. in this room like two seconds ago? Stone. Dude, I am racking up the world serpent scales. Ready yourself. Yeah. Um, excuse me, that totally should have hit me. Yeah. I saw. So I should keep my expectations low, but always expect an attack? It is a delicate balance. Expect the worst, assume nothing, and always anticipate an attack. Sure is a lot to remember. Please. Just let me through. I'll take fighting wolves. And only one room Freaking left. any day. I know I How do you know hope, one room were left? I only saw the two we'll rooms. No. Let's 
Get out of here. Am I like not seeing all these rooms that you're seeing? Because. Oh, I guess I'm not. Okay. Let's go. Oh yeah, nothing bad can be in here. In this freaking boss arena. Grab this. Powerful ice beam that slows enemy on contact. Ice beam, huh? That's interesting. I do think I want to change my light attack. I do like this. Okay. Fine. This off. Then. Excuse me. Hey. So, you back to piss on my corpse, you ungrateful little? Uh, who are you two? We're looking for a whetstone. Have you seen it? Aye, there was one in this room. My son sharpened his dagger on it, right before stabbing me in the back. What? Little bastard thought it was his turn to lead my crew. I was hard on him, sure. Hmm. Guess I shouldn't be surprised. I did the same thing to my dad when I was his age. He killed his own father? Where is he now? <laughs> he may be a bastard, but he's my bastard. You'll get no help from me, fool. Then his dagger will help. Hey! That's mine! Hey! Come, boy. We are leaving. Um. Um. Yep. Why is there still combat music playing? Are you still here? Hmm. We're a pair of pasty fiefs, just sure can't fight. I'll give you that. Go! Alright, see ya. All these are open now, huh? Why would his son betray him like that? Kill his own father? Over some treasure? It seems so greedy. Remember what I told you, boy. Don't assume nothing. Well, sure. He didn't seem like a great father. But... Oh, you only know half the story. Yes. Hey there, big boy. Fire. 
take this elsewhere, please? Ow. Some more health, please. Anywhere? Health? Please? Nice miss, nice miss. What just happened? Oh, he knocked. Oh. Alright, there we go. Ooh, he's got some health. Uh, pardon me? Yep, I'm dead. I'm not hurt, I'm dead. Thank you. I guess we don't have to kill this thing, but I really want to for the for the mats and the stats, you dig? All right, so like, what am I? Okay. Focus up, boy. Anything pop out, y'all? That was a miss. Okay. Alright, yeah, I'm dead. So, like, see? Well, I guess I could do this. Hey. Give me some health back, please. Thank you. Oh, I didn't know I could do this. I can't. Okay. Good to know. Okay, that's not what I thought it was. See ya. Come on. Oh, he's stunned. What up? You dead. Beastiary updated. Yeah, well, their hearts are like very valuable, so. Hey, uh, what's your name? Dude? I would like to purchase a resurrection stone from you if that is at all possible. Greetings. You uh didn't happen to find that 
Whetstone, perchance. We found no whetstone. But this dagger belongs to the reaver who took it. They took most of the good stuff. Oh? Well, here, take this. In exchange for the dagger. Activate while aiming to slow down time. The dagger you brought me is quite interesting. An artless design, but the construction is sound. Where in the temple did you find this? In a reaver's back. Oh. Oh. He mentioned he was part of a larger clan. Maybe they took the Woodstone? Quite possibly. I know I've seen this design before. I have a favor to ask. Just a small favor, really. Yeah, well, like, first I'm gonna need... to buy a resurrection stone. Ooh, I missed this. It's, yeah, I need to sell some of my stuff. Don't need that. It's below level five. Get it out of my sight. Okay. Strength and earning. Nine. That's level six. Defense eight. Cool down. Was there something else? Yeah. Uh, two seconds. Oops. Before my tower. Let's do that. Before luck, dude. Still level four. Okay. What? Whoop. What are we? Level five and level six. All right. Do you What's remember up, the dagger you gave him? <laughs> yeah, I just gave it to you. to the reaver's back? His own son killed him? Yeah. I haven't forgotten that one. Well, I traced it to a group of reavers that operate out of the Northry stronghold. I'd wager that's where they took their haul from Fafnir's storeroom. Along with that whetstone that I could use to help you. <sighs> Another treasure hunt. Pointless. Pointless. We're gonna do it, my dude. Retrieve the whetstone. Well, yeah. not if Sindri really can make us better equipment with that whetstone. Plus, the Reaver's son. He murdered his father. Don't ask what if I tried to murder my father because Zeus had it coming. So... Alright. So that is like way the balls up there huh how are we going to get up there so why do they call Odin the lord of the hang that refers to a modest example of Odin's thirst for knowledge. The time he spent nine days a dead man, hung himself by the neck from Yggdrasil's branches, put his spear through his own side, and bled down into the Well of Destiny. He roamed the realms of the dead and plundered the world tree of its secrets, until I think quite rightly it got fed up with him and sent him back to the land of the living. Did I not mention he was barking mad? Mamir's Tales, or added. Ooh, I forgot about that. Oh. Okay. 
it on the butt. What level are you? Hey. What level are you? It doesn't say. Just says that you're a Death Eater? Excuse me? Ow? I mean, I sure I could beat him, but I don't really want to. Actually, yeah, I do. I kind of want to. I'll give him a couple more tries. Help. Yeah, yeah. I can't see them. Where is he? There he is. <laughs> Let's go. And then we're gonna he's gonna throw the thing up in the air, and then I'm gonna be like, down on your head. He's done it. What's his sauce? I do like that. It doesn't have quite the stun though, but I do like it. Bestiary updated. Death Eater. Mother never mentioned this troll. Guess he never did anything special or earn an interesting bedtime story, and now he never will. Dang. Harsh. So we want to go this way. an entire city under the water. My lad, a forgotten city. What was it called? Now, uh, well, I forgot. Makes sense. 
Can we... What was that noise? Amir, how'd you come to be in these lands? Lad, there comes a time in every man's life when he changes his name and heads north to make a new start. If you live long enough to do this many times over, you might end up as far north as this place. By the time I arrived, I already knew Odin by his reputation, and so I set to demonstrate my worth by coming to him with something I knew he'd value. A mystic well of knowledge. Or rather, I should say, a well of water laced with enough mystic mushrooms to make a god see visions. Oh, he was rightly impressed. Can't say for sure what he saw that led him to try gouging out his own eyes, but I managed to restrain him before he finished the job. Then I persuaded him it has been his sacrifice made for an even higher form of sight to be bestowed. Blah, de blah, de blah, de blah. I used to think he never caught on. But the day he took my eye, I realized he had never been fooled. He knew I'd outwitted him, called the lesson wisdom, and hired me to make sure from then on I was on his side. And for a long, long time I truly was. Doesn't mean he didn't hold a grudge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna come up here and see what that freaking noise was. Grab some health. Oh, uh, hey. Rude? Holy crap, I just couldn't freaking move. Father! Yeah, get me up. Ow. Fierce Ogre. Our enemies are strong. Lee Osta. Hello. Couple of world serpent scales, okay. I'll take them, thank you. Okay, there's one. Let's see. Can't see that from down here. Okay. You got for me. Hexel, of course. Um. Okay. 
We are not lifting that. Good. See any more runes, boy? I do not. I do not. Okay. Over here. Cannot open that. Okay, good. Still looking for runes. There's one right there. Did I miss? There we go. Alright, now. Let's see if we can fight this guys or these guys or not. Oh. Okay. to this thing. Anything? Nothing. Okay. So, I think we're supposed to, like, carry you up somewhere, maybe? No, because I can't climb with it, right? Alright, we'll just put you right here for now. Let's go take a gander at what else we're dealing with here. I open that. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Okay. Good. Like shortcuts. Um, greetings. Don't talk to me. Assuming I need to carry it over here. That was easy. That was easy. You are correct. Alright, so this was a shortcut right here. Need to go down here. Grab this. Boy. You see any more runes of that we need to throw of the axe at. I am not seeing any. Put that there. Thank you. Okay. Can you shoot that? Okay, I guess that didn't do anything. Did I just hear? Look. Oh. 
busy here, if you don't mind. What? Oh, bro. Atreus, follow me. Be right there. Come down here real quick. I want to grab this before I forget. Let's climb back up. Still not seeing this last room, though, which is kind of bugging me, if I'm honest. I would like to find it. There it is. I have it. Okay. So what's up here, then? Are we really going to do this? Alright, you know what? Let me get out of here. Let's take care of the freaking guys shooting stuff, throwing stuff at me, whatever they're doing. Ow. Okay, you need to die. You know what? At the Supposed to explode? That's rude. Please? Please? Okay. Thank you. Ah! Freaking stop exploding. Okay. So there is a place for another one of those things. A spectral squirrel to unearth consumables, huh? I mean, imagine that's fairly handy. something to put in there. Got it. Thank you. Um, okay. So, is this like... What is this? Drop. Jump. Run up here. Okay. So the Okay, this other bridge was just to get to this. Okay, okay. I I I underdig it. I underdig it.
I do not understand. Pick me up. Nope. Okay. <sighs> I mean, this is doable. You know, I was just... So these are frost dudes, and I was being a big dumb and using my frost axe. It's not good. Not a good idea. I should not be doing that. So this time, I will not use my frost, and I will use these bad boys wrong way. How the heck did I kill the shield guy so fast the first time? I do not understand. I wonder if, um, you know what, I'm gonna like do something different this time. Can do this.
That's some BS, honestly. Come on! Alright, this is doable. I just... I think I was locked on and didn't want to be and I couldn't really move. That's such a dumb attack. In a corner. I just got freaking greedy there. I'm gonna get this. Oh, this was the wrong one.
wonder. Did it, boy. It was scary, but we done did it. Back up here. And grab these. Thank you. Alright, and now we need to go down and grab the last thing from the room chest. Is that a fish? That's a fish. If this... Where am I? Hello? Oh, here I am. Hey, there's some health back here. I'm gonna go ahead and just... If you don't mind. There we go! He's done it. Hey. Collected all of the apples. All right, where did I drop down from? Right there. Because there was a. I think yeah, it's yeah yeah, yeah that's it. Okay. Where am I? Okay, yep, 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 yep. I know where I am. Alright, let's get out of here and continue on our quest for the witch dude. Ooh, there's another dewdrop thing over here. If you don't mind, I'm gonna grab it. get why you ever wanted to work for Odin. Back then, I was young enough to still be ambitious. The Aesir gods were as powerful a force as I'd come across, but they clearly lacked for strategy, focus, and sage counsel. All this could I faithfully provide. And so, a stranger from a far-off island found himself with Odin's ear, trusted as he trusted no one but himself. And with that kind of power, laddie, I must confess, there are perks. Yeah, but he's Odin. I never claim to be perfect, laddie. Only clever. And often too clever by half. So what'd you do to get Odin so mad at you? Well, for a long time my job was to enable Odin. And I was fucking excellent at it. Gradually, as I grew more to care about people and the world, my job became to contain him. To protect him from himself. By serving peace, I served his interests as well. That's the truth. But he saw it as disloyalty. No longer trusting my motives, but not wishing to part with my brain or tongue, he bound me to a tree and adopted a new pastime of casual torture. Well, I'm glad we came along to cut off your head. Aye, lad. Lucky break, that was. Hidden area discovered. Ruins of the ancient. Oh. <laughs> This is lovely. Excuse me. Alright. Hey. Look here. Yes, sir.
Hit you a couple times if you don't mind. Stunned again? Nice. And you're dead. Hopefully. You're not dead. Well, this is awkward. Now you're dead. Increases resistance to poison by 20%. Ancient whose soul has been removed by dark dwarven magic is stronger than a regular soul eater, and even those still terrifying. That was not stronger than the soul eater we fought. I'm sorry. Boy. Boy. Read. Please. Gulvig's bones. What will you say to her? To Gulvig? Your mother. What have you left unsaid? I... I guess... I just want to know if she's okay. She is dead, boy. I know that. I... You don't understand. Neither do you. Please? Please? Why did I like to break the game here when I tried to read that? Ah, Alright, here's what we're going to do. Save. Yawns. Okay, and then we we're going to go to load. Do, 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 do. Purchase or discover better equipment. 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 Shocked enemies are locked in place and unable to attack. All right. Please. Thank you. Boy. Sir. It's another treasure map. Great. Symbol of tenacity. All right. That's done. Let's continue on our journey. Actually, let's take a gander at our armor. This is level 6, level 6, level 6. Good. 6, level 4. Okay. That's a level 7, my dude. Let's do it. Oops. Press the wrong button. Put it on level seven. Okay. These are now both levels. Okay. So we do we have anything that is lower than a six? I do not believe so. Okay. The mirror. There was a shrine about a giant lady with lots of books and, and visions. Ah, that would be Groa, the knowledge keeper. 
She was a gifted sorceress, who gathered every tome of arcane wisdom she could find in the realms, all in the hopes of augmenting her powers of prophecy that she might find her lost husband, Arvandil. But it was not her husband she would glimpse in her visions, for it was Groa, seeing longer and farther than any before or since, who witnessed Ragnarok, the end and the beginning. When Odin caught word of her ultimate prophecy, he maneuvered to obtain her knowledge and hoard it for himself. Groa knew Odin as a long-time patron of her services, and so she welcomed him into her library as a friend. <laughs> what she did not know is that Odin himself was behind her husband's disappearance, having used his enchantments to conceal his death at Thor's hands from her sight. Smiling, jealous Odin took her by the throat, and with his very hands he stole her library and her life for his own. I always knew Odin was bad, but that's just... Ruthless? Barbaric? Heartless? That's Odin. In fact, we would do well to sit here in silence for the next few moments and reflect on Odin's capacity for cruelty. And so... Reflect longer. Please turn, thank you. Oops. Once you retrieve the whetstone, please take utmost care while handling it. It is a priceless relic, after all. I didn't think we'd see you out here, since you and Brock got back together. Everything okay? Oh, here? better than ever. You know, I really think we both are alone and are years apart. So how come you're back here? Just catching some fresh air. <laughs> Look, I love my brother. But he still smells like a fetid dung pot. I mean, that's pretty cool, if you ask me. So, I heard you and Brock are kind of famous. Well, you're half right. Whatever did you hear? That you made Thor's hammer. Oh, yes, we did do that. So Mjolnir put us on the map. The legendary run. Gods and kings knew our brand. We really did make quite a team. So what happened? Oh, well, that's a long story. Things happened that made it difficult to find that certain spark, you know? Inspiration is a fickle mistress. Huh? Oh, enough distractions. You see the mess I have to clean up around here? What speaks to you? Well... I would like to get some of this armor that I cannot afford, but alas, I cannot afford it. Mist Echoes Niflhelm Alloy Evaldi's Rusted Armor. Okay. Oh, no, we can't forget you. Oh, you know what? I have been forgetting. <laughs> about them. Oops. Okay. Hope it's not too shiny. And back to you. 
cannot afford smolt. Fourteen smoldering. Have a level three strength, luck, runic, and luck. Okay, axe pump. Okay, so it doesn't really matter. Blades pump. What level is my blades pummel? Upgrade. Blades pummel. It is a level five. We would like to buy a resurrection stone. Thank you. Be seeing ya. Bye. Yeah. Turn around. Every now and then I get a little bit. Um, I still can't believe the son would kill his own father. That's crazy, right? I know. You only got one side of the story. But come on! His own father? I mean, I get angry at you sometimes, but... Do you? I mean, sometimes, yeah. A little. But I'd never stab you in the back. No. I imagine not. Um, greetings? This clan really didn't want anyone coming in. How are we supposed to get there? There must be a way to lift the gate. Maybe with the big water wheel. My thought as well. Big old dangle water wheel. Hey. Goodbye. Sounded behind? It was not. Hello? She also was not ready. A tough fight. Was it? I do not believe well, that was a tough fight. However, it was a fight of that mechanicry. Completely unnecessary. I just freaking love the way it looks. Whoa!
still would like to figure out how to get back in down. Seems to be from the other side. Somewhere. I guess sometimes when you don't think I can do something, but I can. It is not always easy to know what. It's okay. I get it. I'm little. Where's that whetstone? I wonder. <sighs> okay, we're not going that way. Hey, ugly. The combos. <gasps> oh, yeah, you explode. That's showing them. I see it back there. I do not know what it is, but I see it. Here, another raven. Oh, that was a lovely surprise. I did not know it was going to be there. Solid steel, world serpent scales. That's where I climbed up. Okay. What is that? You see that? What is it? climb over there? I guess I didn't even look. Are we lost? Nah. Nah. Yeah, we can't climb over here.
boy, over here. Yes, sir. Okay, that's going in the journal. What does it say? To know the horizon is to know the brutal history of these lands. Before the Great Flood, before the Desolation, men lived peacefully in Midgard. The dead stayed dead, Draugr were a rarity, and the use of satyr magic was considered deeply shameful. The Hrez is of the old ways, when a man's worth is measured by how well he swings a blade. Strength, our highest virtue. These are harsh lands, and they are no place for the weak. The strong will prosper in life, and in death join the ranks of the Enherar in Valhalla. The weak will scrape oops, sorry. The weak will scrape and suffer a meager existence, joining the ranks of unworthy in the depths of Helheim. Such is the cycle of life till Ragnarok comes. Harsh they sound impeccable. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Nope, did not want to climb. Thank you for asking. Down. Alright, and we go back up. So, what was back here then? Oh. It's a long way down, ain't it, boy? Investigate the Reaver ship. Okay. Please. Something bad happened here. This is the sun. That ghost son? How do you know? The sigil. It matches the dagger we found in his father's back. He stood his ground, but it was not enough. They betrayed him. Betrayal begets betrayal. My guess, the young one murdering his dad didn't sit well with the others. He thought himself ready to lead. It cost him his life. I guess. Look there, lad. By his feet. The whetstone! Yes. They used it to smash his face in. They did? Ew. Focus hmm. um, up. Reading?
Shattered Gauntlet of Ages. Epic Talisman. An ancient, ancient, ancient relic of hell deemed too powerful to remain whole. Fragments of your former strength lie scattered throughout the realms. Okay, it doesn't even say what it does though, so... Like, could it even be good? Are you having fun up there? I wonder why they left this what's going on. If Sindri wants it, it must be really useful. Well, our beavers have very specific priorities. If it's not shiny and you can't eat or drink it, might as well use it as a blunt object. Very good. Very good. I would like to get in here. Can't shoot through there, can you? Yes, you can. Treasure map. There's a scroll here. Nope. It belonged to the sun. Dad, while you were off hunting and pillaging, Dan, Dan Grad, Granddad raised me, taught and cared for me. I loved him, and you stabbed him in the back. I hated you, but time is a way of changing things. The clan celebrated. They spat on his kind spirit, saw it as proof of weak leadership. And as much as I hate to admit it, the Hrells of Ferrara thrives with you at the realm. As a boy, I made an oath to the Normir that I would avenge him. My skill with the blade grew, and you finally began to notice me. We grew closer, but the Nornir did not suffer broken oaths, not even these made by a grieving child. Their chest outside Fafnir's storeroom, it reminded me of that oath. So the cycle of betrayal continues. You killed the only father I ever knew, but even now I regret my actions and am filled with remorse. <laughs> forgive me. Wow, this goes on and on. Father, forgive me. Filled with remorse. Forget my actions. Hmm... Had he thought before taking action, there would be no need for regret, yes? Yeah. Maybe we should bring this to his father, back at the storeroom. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, but first, like, I want to come in here. You don't mind? Dock here? Yawns. Okay, so we could go that way. There's 
sure is a lot to see here. There's still that one chest, but I don't know if we're going to get to it. Because it's like... I don't even know. This I way. see something down there. Yes, could I? I have a question. If Ymir was the first giant, where did he come from? In the beginning, there was Ganungagop, the Great Void. There were no realms yet, only primordial forces. There was fire, and there was ice. And there in the void, they met and produced... Water? More than water. The mystic lifeblood of something entirely new. From this water, Ymir took form and became a being of pure creation and chaos, mother and father to all that came after. Even the Aesir? Aye. Every god, man and beast came first from Ymir's flesh. Though it was the Aesir who thought themselves so superior that they should hold dominion over the rest of creation. It was Odin who took arms against his creator and spilled Ymir's lifeblood with his spear. A necessary evil, he would say, to bring order to the realms. From Ymir's torn flesh, Odin would fashion the realm of Midgard for his own. Called himself All Father as if he was the creator and not the creator's destroyer. The small, covetous tyrant. Amir? Huh? Oh, sorry, my boy. Ah, uh, you know, I think at best we just end it there, actually. Yeah, probably a good idea. You didn't happen to find the whetstone, perchance. We found your whetstone. Oh! Wonderful! This staining is unusual. The Reavers used it to smash another Reaver's face in. Oh. Wonderful. Here. For your trouble. Yo. Hi. Strength down. Luck way up. Can't wait to test out the new whetstone. It may not look like much. But it's practically humming with magic. I've needed a new one after my brother borrowed the last one. I saw him spit on it. To lube it up, he said. I didn't ask for it back. Two dragon tears? Okay. Sometimes the best purchase is the one we don't love. You're telling me. All right. So... One more thing, and then I'm going to call it, it is called this one. What's this one? Recover his bones? Yeah, we're going to do this one. And I think we should be able to fast travel near there, hopefully. Go ahead and zoom out. It was right here. Fafnir's store. Okay, so we go. Here's something I can't figure out. Odin wants to prevent Ragnar. But the serpent's already been there and seen it. So hasn't he already failed? Beats a tricky thing, lad. And Odin's just arrogant enough to think he can get the best of it. Fate is another lie told by the gods. Nothing is written that cannot be unwritten. On that, brother, you and the Old Father may just agree. Even if he can't prevent Ragnarok, he still hopes to learn enough details to influence the outcome. Remind me later to tell you about the wolves. The wolves. 
scare you? Wow. Wow. Okay. Right. Please. Thank you. What? Brock and I are working on something special for you at the temple. Really? Why? Okay, here we go. Find you, watch Man, the juggling is just so real. I never did find that crow back there, did I? A raven, whatever. What are you fools doing back here? Come to pill for my boots and small clothes. We found your son. He. He was betrayed too. And we found part of his journal. It sounded like he regretted killing you. <laughs> Fat lot of good that does me. How'd he go out? Did I fight him? We found four corpses near his. They were decapitated. Ha! Vandrid always did keep his sword nice and sharp. A lesson he picked up from me. <sighs> he's a backstabbing bastard, but knowing he's in Valhalla sets me at ease. Thanks. Let's go. We did a good thing. I'm glad we came stats. back here. That thief did not deserve the peace you gave him. Maybe so. Still, it feels good to help people. Even the dead. Does it feel good to help people now? <laughs> so much like your mother. All right, so let's go back to the shop and see what they're cooking up for me. What is this? Aha! Uh -huh. Hacksilver. Not a Hacksilver. Eternal Frost. Unmeldable eyes from the furthest reaches of hell used to upgrade pommels with frost damage effects. Found in treasure map caches. Eye of Runic Mastery. Taking damage during a rune attack reduces damage taken. Uh, okay. That was completely accidental, but I'll take it, dude. I've been working on a new project at the temple. Come yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going now. So. Uh. Let's just. Mimir, why do you have Bifrost crystals in your eyes? A loving gift from the giants. 
Since I used to do so much travelling between realms, they thought it would be more convenient for me than having a crystal I could lose. Did it hurt? No, because I wisely fortified myself with 16 cups of Billow Maiden's Ale. Got so inebriated, I tried convincing the giants to put him in my nipples instead. <laughs> Almost talked them into it too. Can you imagine? Mimir of the Bifrost Teats. <laughs> ah, those were the days. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll stop now. Whoa. Whoa. Hey guys. My brother and me got a new project. Now that we're on speaking terms. What oh. do you want? More With dwarven the quests. And hammer you've retrieved for us. Brock and I can construct the Devagrathiker, dwarven armor of legend. We just need three more mythical ingredients before we set to hammer. Which are? Don't know. Armor's pure legend, and the details is fuzzier than a wolver's butthole. You expect us to find parts from a legend? Oh, Motsognir the Dwarf King found two of them. Everyone knows that. But when he went looking for the third, poof, he vanished. Maybe he'll find some clues at his stronghold in Konungsgard. And looky here, a Konungsgard entry stone. It's got your name on it. How fucking strange. That is fairly strange. You're correct. The stronghold right. is northwest of here, behind the Svartalfheim realm tower. Large stone structure, creepy atmosphere. You'll know it when you see it. Yep, yeah, thanks. The Huldra Brothers, uh. back in action again. Oh, I can't wait to get started. I think I'd see such a day we was back to building as a duo. Kay. But it feels right, especially for this. Since I used to building on my own all these years, almost forgot how dang useful an extra pair of hands is. Yeah, I forgot how much easier oh. it is to smelt scap's leg with someone else gauging the temperature. This will be our best work yet. Just need a little help from you lot. Yeah. Are you done? Okay. I am going to call it here. So uh, next time we will go after this legendary armor material stuff. Uh, till then, thanks for watching. See you next time. Later.